Hi crafty friends, it's Audra Monk the Crafty Yogi and welcome to my Monday night occasions catalog new product unboxing. It's my pre-order. Um, so we'll get there in just a moment, but first I want to take a moment to share with you. Um, earlier today I posted, oh I should have brought it over here, but it's okay, about the blizzard Shoot, I might just be called the blizzard snowflake die. I'm not sure. But it cuts out a bunch of snowflakes. And I wanted to share with you this super pretty card I got to make this afternoon. But it was a little bit too late to take a picture. I'll take one in the morning. We're making this at class on a Wednesday night or Friday morning. And look, I spritzed the snowflakes. I used our Highland Heather. Um, and you might notice a new product that I just took out of the box this afternoon. The stitch shape framelits. I'm going to talk about those in a second. Um, but on Wednesday, we're going to make a two-card set. This paper is the paper I laid the snowflakes on when I spritzed them. So isn't that cool? Super fun. Snowflakes can be Christmassy or not Christmassy. So if someone wants to make this say Merry Christmas or this say Merry Christmas, they totally can. So anyway, there's my snowflake cards. I was just so excited about this one. It was so pretty. I saw a lot that were similar, so I had to give a go. Okay, so... Now let's get started. We're going to take a break, a pause from all things Christmas, which I think sometimes this time of the month uh, towards Christmas we need to do. So welcome to everybody that's joining me. I'm going to do a short video here showing you what I purchased in the pre-order. Okay, so our occasions catalog starts on January 3rd and it runs through June 3rd. In conjunction with that catalog, through January 3rd through March 31st, you can earn free stuff. And free stuff is awesome. Um, so I'm going to share what I got on this second. I had a pre-pre-order because I went to on stage and I got a little bit. And same thing this time, I got a little bit. Um, so I'll show you what I got and what was free and what is new. So if you need a catalog and you don't have a demonstrator already, contact me, Audra Monk, at yahoo.com, or give me a message on here, and I will get one to you. If you live in the Frederick, uh, Maryland area, you can stop by and pick one up. I'm having an open house. Oh my goodness, I meant to look up the date. Sunday, January, I think, 13th. So uh, check my website. It, it'll be on there. Okay, so let's see. What did I order? I'm going to start with this one. Um, our mas uh, masculine set. I always try to get at least one masculine set. People who went to on stage, they could order this, but I, I didn't need it yet, so I waited. Um, there's a really cool stamp set. Ha <laughs> ha, you jumpstart my heart. I don't think I noticed that before. With a car and toolboxes and things like that, and a cool little atmosphere stamp. I'm a fan of those. A nice big Happy Father's Day. There are dies to cut a lot of those things out. And then there are gears, and look at this big gear. I like this. At on stage, we made we decorated this cute little pizza box um, with the gears, and then the DSP and the ribbon. So I'm going to show you those too. You know I love designer series paper, and one thing I really love it is Stampin' Up always puts always or very often one side will have flowers or in this case wrenches, and look the other side is just a pattern. Although this is tire, it's tire treads. That's really cool. So it's nice that you get both. So look at those little uh, oil cans, keys with little dice. So the paper, oh, a little trail map, little signs, some pretty orange. So it makes the paper pretty flexible that you can use it for other things. It doesn't have to always go with this set. Oh, those are cute. Little um. What do you call those? Gauges. More tire tracks. So things like that. So this is nice and bright colors. Um, I don't remember exactly what colors they are, but you know we can look them up later. So there's that DSP. There's the stamp set. There's the dies. There's a really cool ribbon with black and silver, which I think could go lots of ways. I could see um, a New Year's card with this, a wedding card with this. Um, of course, you can only order pre-order this if you're a demonstrator. So if you ever want to be on that order early list, feel free to contact me about joining my team. We could do that. Oh, and then there's also these, look, little tiny um, keys and wrenches. Let's see, am I too close? There we go. Maybe you can see them there. So those are super cute. Okay, so I think that's all of that said. Let me set that aside. Oh, and I almost forgot. So... 
I just spent the weekend in Miami with my honey. Um, he's there for work, and so I decided to go down and see him. So there's a reason I didn't craft all weekend, but that's okay. I'll be back to working on Christmas cards and cleaning, cleaning up my giant mess. You, you won't believe it, but if you come on Wednesday, it'll all be ready for class. But anyway, there we are at, at dinner. So that was pretty fun. I wanted to show you that. Okay, so let's see what's next. What is next? Let's take a look. At these rectangle stitch I already have them out and on a magnet because you know what these are gonna get used all the time I use my ovals my circles my squares um, they cut in and out so in this example you only see one layer of stitching if you cut your paper just the right size you will see two uh, layers of stitching which is really cool but they're all nice rectangle shapes. So you're definitely going to want to get those. Don't be surprised if they occasionally go on back order. I have a feeling these are going to be a hot ticket item. If they're on your list, you need to order them uh, straight up when the catalog goes live. Okay, stitch shape framelits. Next, for all my pet lovers out there, I am super excited about both of these. We have the Happy Tails stamp set and a punch. So if you love dogs, you know what, we're gonna punch something out. Do you have a scrap of paper? I always have a scrap of paper. I have a messy desk, so it means you always have paper nearby. Here we go. We're gonna punch a bright yellow dog. So you slide this in there, give it a punch. Oh, there's a little, cute little heart too. And look at that cute little dog shape. Wasn't he adorable? Or she? So you can um, make dogs. A best friend leaves a paw print on your heart. Rough, rough. So sorry for your loss. Keep calm and wag on. There's a little dog house. Isn't that cute? And you can make your dog spotted. So lots of fun that you can have with dogs. We already have a cat punch. So now we have a cat stamp set. And I adore this. Meow. Um, you're the cat's meow. A friend like you comes around once in nine lives. So your cat lover, you could send them that for their birthday card. Lots of different ways to decorate your cat and your... Um, yarn your little mice so lots of fun and I think these are both yeah they're both photopolymer stamp sets so you might want those you might want to add those to your order I think at my open house I'm going to have one with the dog because I think that'll be fun um okay mm, you know what I didn't plan where to put the stuff okay next up let's take a look at our memories and more set um this is our pocket scrapbooking um we sell the pages and then we sell, and this is what I love, my favorite part are the stickers to add to your um, cards. You can use these. Oh, those are awesome stickers. If you wanna make the quickest cards ever, buy this and buy the, the note cards that we sell that are coordinated to this sizing and you can make cards with no stamping. So if you wanna do it, you can look. Happy birthday. And you get two of each. Let's see what other phrases are in here. If there's some. Wishing you all the best. You just stick that on a card, add a sticker, or add a ribbon, and you are done. So if that's the kind of card maker you need to be, that's okay. Oh, happy day. So you can do those. There's the big pieces, and then there's the little pieces. Um, and I mostly use them for scrapbooking. Thinking of you, but look at that. Mount that on some paper, put it on a card. Easy peasy. Um, I am going to do a scrapbooking set of classes coming up in uh, January, February, March, something like that. So look for that. I'm planning to, once this whole uh, next week or so is done, I'm planning to work on a bunch of videos and a bunch of plans, and I'll get all the information out to you in the first couple weeks of January. Okay, so Memories and More Cards, and they're called Happiness Blooms. And there is DSP that is coordinated to this and a stamp set and little tiny punches. I got the punches last time. Um, so there's, there's other parts you can add to that. Okay, so that's that. Next up, high on my list was this uh, Sweetest Thing set. There is a stamp set. There we go. Make it a sweet celebration. Happy birthday. They're cute little candy jars. I love, you're going to laugh, I love dishes. Maybe that's why I like paper so much. I love dishes and I love um, bowls and, you know, I don't really need any more, but somehow I occasionally keep buying them. So a photopolymer set. There are framelits to cut out the jars and there's extra bonus framelits to cut out candy. Okay, and it's just that one. And to do the, what do you call this? Not emblem, label. There's a framelit for the label. There is a beautiful ribbon, and it's two colors. I'm pretty sure that's Granny Apple Green, maybe Bermuda Bay. Let's see. Let's look at the paper. 
So a cool thing, if you don't know, on the back of all of our DSP, now if you get the six by six, like the um, car one, you gotta look it up in the catalog because it, it's not on the label. Oh, I bet it's Coastal Cabana. And it lists the colors in your paper. So isn't that a cool ribbon that it's two colors? So I think that's really fun and it's super soft. So I think it'll tie some beautiful knots or if you really want some beautiful bows. The DSP, which I did here, or C, oh, but see, look, polka dots. So if you don't, like, I might not use this with the really big, bold pattern on a card, although I might. This is kind of cute. Look at the back. Just beautiful dots. You can make a baby card out of this. You can make a birthday card for a man out of this. Lots and lots of choices. <laughs> I do like the little gummy bears. And look, oh, look at those beautiful stripes. They're so pretty. Um, polka dots of bright, bold, fun colors. Um, great for cards for kids. Oh, those are really pretty. Great for cards for grown-up. Look at that rainbow page. Couldn't you just see? Oh, it's too bad. Remember that little unicorn we had last year? Oh, that would look super cute with this rainbow. Candy things. So I think these candy pieces you can cut out with the dies if you want a pre-done jar for you. Oh, bubble gum. And is that the last one? Oh, one more. More candy jars. So very pretty, very bold, very bright. So we have that little sweet, which is wonderful. Okay, let's see. Next up, oh, and you know what? I think these ribbons match. Um, in our celebration catalog, so I got these ribbons for free. Spend $50 and you get this little set of one, two, three, four, five colors of ribbon for free. So you can use those to craft uh, with, and it's really cute. It's sheer in the middle and the color on the edges. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that kind of coordinates with there. Another thing I ordered on at On Stage, they do Prize Patrol. I got this really awesome stamp set for free, or well, I paid to go to the event, so whatever. But it was fun to get it. And so there are framelits called Well Written Framelits, and they have lots of good words: friend, wishes, birthday. It's pretty funny to read them backwards. Um, love, thanks, you. Um, so lots of cool words to go with all the words on your sets, which makes it super fun because you can make your own sayings. This is a really awesome set. Not the least expensive set in the book, but I think one that is going to get a lot of use. Okay, so I got those. All right, I think I got all that stuff. Um... This is really pretty. I did get a pack of this on my pre-pre-order, which I showed you. This is the Valentine, or the paper in the Valentine suite. I've got to show it to you. Look at that. And so I'm also going to offer a paper share. i got to do all the math and figure it out. But if you would like to get a little bit of all of the new paper, let me know. It'll be discounted so that, I mean, the price will be the same as if you order it, but you don't have to order it all. So you're going to get a little bit of everything. Look at that paper. Oh, it's lovely. And we are definitely making Valentine's this year. And I'm going to do a beautiful, beautiful sampler at the end of January uh, using this paper. So you have to I adore it. And then, super cool, coordinating to this paper. And I just opened this. Look at this. This is metallic, lovely lipstick paper. It's free. I got it for free. I ordered $50 of stuff. And I got this paper for free. It comes in lovely lipstick and grapefruit grove oh my gosh it's so shiny with the lights on the camera it's beautiful i'm telling you i may like the level of the lipstick just a little better but for valentine's and our uh valentine sampler it is going to be amazing look at it sparkle and shine and you can get it for free with the 50 dollars purchase so you're definitely going to want to get that all right and uh, what else did I get for free? Okay, so now we're just to free stuff. I think I showed you all the new stuff I got. Again, more designer series paper. This, a lot of people got this already and I've seen cards coming. <gasps> Can you not love that black and white gingham? I mean, the butterflies are cute, but look at that. And look at this butterfly paper. That is beautiful. And oh, polka dots. Oh my gosh, okay, so I'm pretty much gonna get buckets of this paper. Look at the little black and white uh, butterflies and the cool kind of purple graphics. What else? Oh, more black and white butterflies. You could color them or not color them. Green leaves, black stripes. Look at this paper. 
Oh my gosh, you can get this for free. Okay, so now apparently there's a lot of really good free things, so you may have to order a lot. Um, but that's okay, I can help you with that. Um, if you're a demonstrator, it works the same way. It's $50 retail, which you get at at least a 20% discount, and then you still get the free items. All right, and then my last couple free items, and I will send you on your way. Um, I got two uh, free stamp sets, and they're both in our new cling. I am going to do a video. If you've seen some other demonstrators, that's okay, but I'll show you too. Um, the stickers are sticky. So I'm just going to peel off just an edge. Yeah, it comes off this side. So that they will stick to your blocks. Because here in, uh, maybe it comes off this way. Because here in Maryland, in the winter, my um, stamps would fall off the blocks. So normally... I don't stick the stickers on. Like this one, I just use that wedding wishes stamp. I just don't put them on. And I've gotten used to it. My class goers have gotten used to it. But it will be nice to have stickers on. And they're, can you hear that? They're sticky. Yep. And so I will put those on and we'll be able to see those. And I'm going to show you how to put them on. We got to do it a little more careful. And we have to be a little more gentle, I think, with our stamps. And that's okay. So we'll talk about that. Especially if you come to classes, I'm going to... Um, have you be extra careful because they're my stamps, right? So we got to take care of them. Um, same thing for this one. This is called By the Bay. There's a cute little house in a wall, but I really got this for, look, little tiny seashell and the cute little, hmm, are they seagulls? I think they're seagulls. Um, I did see seagulls in Miami Beach. I love the beach, so um, I definitely like those. And then my last free thing, this coordinates um, with the butterflies is these little wood butterfly elements. Um, I suggest glue dots for attaching them to cards, but there's butterflies and flowers. So if you like a little more tactile thing on your card or in your scrapbooking, you can use those. All right, so I think I covered all of the stuff I got. I'm kind of excited for next week to come, so I will have time to create new things to start sharing that with you. Put... I'm pretty sure it's January 13th. Whatever that Sunday is, put that on your calendar to come to my open house. Um, stay tuned. I'll do a few little by mail things too. So if you live far away, there'll still be some perks. Um, and there we go. If you have questions, comments, requests, let me know. And stay crafty. I will see you next time. Take care. Okay, and don't laugh. You know it's hard for me to click this button to turn it off. So hold on.